Today we're checking out Capcom Showcase 6 12 2023 by Capcom USA. Let's dive right on in. All right, here we go. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the Capcom Showcase. Before we get started, we'd like to share that June 11th, 2023 marked Capcom's 40th anniversary. Ah, two days ago. A big thanks to everyone for playing our games. It's thanks to our amazing fans that we can- Mega Man, Devil May Cry, Phoenix Wright. Games in the years to come. And we hope that you'll continue to enjoy them. Now it's time to show off our latest titles at the Capcom Showcase. Stay tuned until the end so you don't miss anything. Path of the Goddess. Whoa, nice katana. That's a big ass sword. Oh god, what are those monsters? Path of the Goddess. Traditional Japanese aesthetics come to life through the power of RE Engine. Experience a unique blend of strategy and action in this epic tale. A beautiful yet unsettling world of mystery awaits in Kunitsugami, Path of the Goddess. Coming to Xbox Series X, Xbox Series S, Windows, PlayStation 5, and Steam. Mega Man X Dive oh, is coming Mega Man! in Android. World Premiere. Dive offline. The deep walk, which holds collected memories of the Mega Man X series, is under attack. Dive into cyberspace using hunter programs to recover data before it's too late.
play as Mega Man X and other characters from the Mega Man franchise, including characters that haven't been playable before. Oh, you can be Sigma. Your favorite characters and equipment to create a powerful hunter. Power up your weapons and more to customize your character however you want. Mega Man X Dive Offline. Control and develop over 100 nice. different characters. Play as a variety of characters, including new heroes created for Mega Man X Dive. Complete stages and use element medals to recover memory pieces. Oh, you even got the and anime girls. Recovered memories to unlock characters. Whoa. Look at all this armor. There are more than 900 stages to play. Challenging mechanics and enemies await on classic and new stages. You're bound to clash with familiar bosses from the past. Build the ultimate hunter and save the deep log from total destruction. Oh. Nice. I think, yeah, Zero and then... <laughs> I think I saw Vile as well. Now, here's the Capcom Spotlight Corner. Spotlight? Street Fighter 6. Fighting games is upon us. Street Fighter 6 launched on June 2nd. It's already received an enthusiastic welcome from fighting game fans around the world. Street Fighter VI includes World Tour, an expansive single-player story mode. Fighting Ground, the core fighting game experience made even more accessible. Ooh. And Battle Hub, a social space where players from around the world can compete and hang out. These ah. are the three main modes. In addition, we're planning to release new fighters and content. Oh, Akuma! Enjoy the game for a long time to come. Street Fighter 6 is out now for PlayStation 5, PlayStation 4, Xbox Series X, Xbox Series S, and Steam. Don't miss it. We also have an announcement for Capcom Pro Tour 2023. This hmm. year's Capcom Pro Tour will feature Street Fighter VI, the newest entry in the series. Oh. Players from around the world will compete in regional matches and battle to be this year's champion. To celebrate the launch of Street Fighter VI, this year we have our largest prize pool ever. The total prize pool for Capcom Pro Tour is over $2 million, with $1 million going to first place. Oh! Capcom Pro Tour 2023 will feature three types of tournaments. Online Premiers, Offline Premiers, World and Warrior. World Warrior. The winners of each tournament will advance to the World Finals at Capcom Cup 10. Stay tuned to see which player will crush the competition and take home this year's championship. Next, we have news about Street Fighter League Pro JP 2023. In Street Fighter League, the world's top players form teams of four and compete in official Capcom Team League matches. Hmm. We have the largest number of teams ever. The opening match will be held on July 7th and will be streamed live on the Capcom Fighters JP channel on YouTube and Twitch. Don't forget about the Street Fighter League World Championship 2023. The US and European leagues will determine the teams that will go on to compete in the World Championship. Get up close and personal mm. with Resident Evil 4 on PlayStation 5. The game's main story will be playable in VR with PlayStation VR 2. Hmm. Thanks to the power of PlayStation VR 2, you'll be able to experience an even more immersive version of the game. Ooh. Take aim nice. as you fight to survive. RE4's cutting-edge knife action is a core part of the game. 
and the PlayStation VR2 Sense controller makes parrying even more intuitive. Experience extreme survival horror firsthand. Whoa, oh my god. Resident Evil 4 VR mode is a free DLC exclusive to PlayStation VR2. Up oh, there goes the spotlight. Now on to the Pragmata. Pragmata. What is she doing? Up you go. Sorry, kid. Still got a ways to go. Whoa. This kid has superpowers. Pragmata. It's almost time for Ghost Trick. Here's the latest on the game. Ooh, Phantom Detective. Hello, everyone. I'm Shu Takumi, the original creator of Ghost Trick. It's almost time for the game's release, and I can't wait for you to play it. But first, let's get set with this. Demo. The demo for Ghost Rick is available now for download. The story says a lonely spirit named Cecil. In the course of solving his own murder, he will meet and change the lives of all sorts of people in all sorts of situations. Things may seem unrelated at first, but each person plays a vital role in Cecil's story. And together, their stories will lead him to one ultimate truth. So think of the demo as a doorway inviting you into a great big mystery mm. it's been 30 years since we made the original game and just like Cecil, i met many new people and there were many miracles that occurred during its development i have no doubt these experiences are what shaped ghost trip into the unforgettable game to the team that lovingly ported this game and to all the fans who have shown so much love towards it i'm so grateful to all of you i'm pleased that through this river, Ghost Trick will be available to so many more people around the world. Now, to wait for its release. Uh, and one more thing. I practiced very, very hard for two weeks for this appearance. So, ah. if me someday, it would make me very happy if it could speak in Japanese. Why was I killed? What was exactly going through that happened to this town tonight? From the creator of the Ace Attorney series, Shu Takumi, this classic mystery game is being reborn. One night, a man named Sissel loses both his memory and his life. Using the powers of the dead, he tries to solve the mystery of his own death. The only clue he has is a red-headed detective. A night of mystery begins anew. Ah. A rookie detective brimming with a sense of justice. She too is being targeted, and Sissel witnesses her death. Who was I? Why was I killed? Who killed me? And what does it mean that I was given these powers of the dead? 
use the powers of the dead to possess and trick items. Oh, that's why it's called Ghost Trick. Glowing blue soul to the core of objects to possess them. Possess the tire. Possess the bowl. Possess the star ornament. You can then trick the objects you possess. Trick the guitar to play it. Hmm. What will happen when you trick the cart? Trick the door to open it. Possessing and tricking objects will let you access new areas. Hmm. Sissel can go back four minutes before someone's death. What happened before her murder? Those clues are hidden in the past. Ah. Follow past events in real time. The limit, however, is four minutes. Help people avoid near-death predicaments and change their fates. Mm -hmm. Fate changed. Sissel will face death in many forms. Changing their fates will change the story. And that story must be linked in some way to the mystery of Sissel's death. Okay. Ghost Trick, launching on June 30th, 2023. Demo version available now. Don't miss the pre-order bonuses. See the official website for details. Now on to the next game in today's lineup. What is it? World Premiere. Capcom. Legal j oh! Ace Attorney. Objection! I'm fine, really. You're clearly lying. We must continue to fritter away time like this. Edgeworth! Spirit of Justice. No, that's not the point I was trying to make. A collection. Nice. In Ace Attorney, players serve as lawyers for the falsely accused. Battle for justice in the courtroom and uncover the truth. Now, the fourth, fifth, and sixth mainline Ace Attorney games are being brought together to share the story of Apollo nice. Justice and his allies in the dark age of the law. On Nintendo Switch, PlayStation 4, Xbox One, Windows, and Steam. The colorful characters and courtroom drama of each game have been relitigated in beautiful full HD. Available nice. in seven languages, Japanese, English, French, German, Korean, and traditional and simplified Chinese. We've also added voice recordings for the new languages. We're sure there's no objection to everything included in this collection. <laughs> Apollo nice. Justice Ace Attorney Trilogy is currently in development for release in early 2024. Please look forward to more information about this collection in the future. Next, we have some Capcom news to share. All right. This month marks Capcom's 40th anniversary. As part of the celebration, we've opened a digital theme park called Capcom Town. Nice. Take a stroll through the museum to view original artwork and other materials from various titles on display. You can even play a few of Capcom's beloved classics for free. Ah. Head on over to the castle to cast your vote in the Capcom elections. 
Participants will receive a special reward, so don't miss out. Nice. Mm. We can't wait for everyone to enjoy these attractions. Along with the many other fun experiences we've prepared at Capcom Town. Capcom ID. A Capcom ID account is required to play Resident Evil RE Verse. Our new upcoming title, Exo Primal, and to use the online features of Street Fighter VI. You can also use this account with other Capcom services and campaigns, such as nice. a survey about today's Capcom showcase. We'll release more titles and services compatible with Capcom ID soon. Register now for Capcom ID. Now for the latest Exo Primal. Exo Primal ahead of next month's launch. Hello everyone. I'm Takedo Hidaoka, the director of Exo Primal. I'm excited to share the latest Exo Primal news with you all. But first, let's check out this video. Hello? Thought I heard activity on this frequency. Hmm. Hello? My name is Garrett Sands. Basically, the IP is Godfather. He was responsible for the entire Exosuit project. You know, Anchor Division, I assume. Exosuits were developed right here. I need access. Uh. It's our only shot. We need access to the past. All my R&D is just waiting to be picked up back in 2040. 2040, wow. They are so in the future. <laughs> Leviathan. Oh my god, look at all those dinosaurs. That's a lot of dinosaurs. It's like dropping dinosaurs, dinosaurs everywhere. Oh my, that is a laser breath. I promise you this, we'll find a way out of here. All anchor project files have serial numbers. Look for anything starting with 181. That's the project code from Leviathan's core. Okay, Doc. Oh, hey, gentlemen, I can get your names. Ah. Uh. The Hammerheads. The Hammerheads. Well done. You fought desperately and survived. The perfect exosuit development project is nearing fruition. Activating Massacre module, summoning Neo T Rex Swarm. Oh, this is all God. to make a better exosuit. Good hunting, Ace. Exo Primal. Presenting my most exciting combat project, the Savage Gauntlet. Ooh. Survival Pass Season 1 Premium Tier. All right. Play day one with Xbox Game Pass. What did you think? That was a lot of new info. Before we dive in, I'd like to give a huge thanks to all the players who participated in the open beta test back in March. We were extremely pleased to have so many participants. Plus, you gave us a lot of invaluable feedback. We can't thank you enough. 
While only portions of the dino survival content were made available for the open beta test, today we'll be introducing more content included in the full game. Let's take a look at really? what okay. expect when Exo Primal launches on July 14th. Let's start with the story. Ace, the game's protagonist, is transported to the year 2040 and forced to participate in a never-ending series of war games. The story unfolds as you play through Dino Survival, the game's main mode. Gathering intel to update the analysis map unravels the mysteries surrounding parallel worlds and the AI entity known as Leviathan. At times, Leviathan. players will also engage in special boss battles as part of the main story. Dino Survival Mode will also change as the story progresses. You'll unlock new missions with a variety of objectives, including 10-player co-op, a multitude of dinosaurs to fight, and more maps. The game will also feature an assortment of unlockables and challenges. Uh. Modules can be used to enhance exosuits and modify active skills. These modules can be obtained by fulfilling certain conditions while you play the game. You can also personalize your appearance with a variety of cosmetics, such as exosuit skins, weapon skins, decals, and emotes. Ooh. The game also features a special five-player mission that changes weekly. Compete with squads from around the world for the fastest completion times, or by earning awards through achievements, like most damage block with a tank suit in battle. There are many ways to enjoy the game, even after completing the main story. Hmm. We took your feedback into consideration as well. In the full version of Exo Primal, we plan to implement a mode where victory is determined by completing missions as quickly as possible, instead of All right. combat with other players. We hope you look forward to that. Now, let's go over all the new info we just saw in the video. Who was that new face at the beginning? Meet Dr. Signs. Dr. Signs. The exosuits. And the head of Anchor Division, IBS's elite research group based on Bikitoa Island. The Stratovator, a space elevator that extends from the Anchor Division research facility into orbit, will also be a playable map. Incredible battles will unfold while exofighters and dinosaurs clash atop this massive space elevator. Ah! Players will even encounter dangerous mutations of dinosaurs known as Neosaurs, the most deadly among them being the Neo T Rex. Whoa! You'll need to work together with your team to stand a chance at taking them down. Oh no! Is that a swarm of Neo T Rexes? Oh what God! What are Leviathan's true intentions? Wait, what's the deal with this new exosuit? Ooh. While it may look similar to Deadeye, this exosuit is a variant called Deadeye Alpha Burst Fighter. Unlike the default Deadeye, this variant comes equipped with a weapon that can burst fire or be used as a shotgun. Nice. Fighters to change their style. Nice, of yo. Exosuit variants, including Deadeye Alpha, will be added in a title update following the full version's release. Oh my god, look at that T-Rex with the red eyes! At the end of the video, we revealed Savage Gauntlet, a mode that lets you take on special five-player missions that change weekly. In this mode, five player. players can enjoy a change of pace from Dino Survival by competing against Exo-Fighters from all over the world for the fastest completion time. More info about exosuit variants and Savage Gauntlet will be revealed at the Xbox Games Showcase Extent. Be sure to tune in. Eh, and last but not least, maybe. We're excited to announce that we'll be holding a second open beta test. This time, we're including additional story-related missions, 10-player co-op missions, and other adjustments based on everyone's feedback. Check out the official website for dates and times. All right. We hope you're all excited to try out this new content. <coughs> Players will also receive a new reward for participating. Don't miss out. We'll continue to make adjustments to Exo Primal, leading up to the game's launch on July 4th. <coughs> Thank you again for all the feedback. 
We look forward to seeing you in the second open beta test. That's all we have for you today. See you in the war games. It's going to be a ton of fun. All right, what's next? Next up is the last title we'll be showing off today. Oh, Dragon's Dogma 2. That's the last announcement, all right. Hi everyone, my name is Hideaki Itsuno, and I'm the director of Dragon's Dogma 2. It's been over a year since we celebrated 10 years of Dragon's Dogma, and I can finally give you some more information about the new game. First, let's take a look at the trailer we revealed the other day. All right. Yeah, that's French. Yeah. You do not remember? Then have you forgotten that you protected me from the dragon's flames? You need only believe in your own destiny, Arisa. Of course. That begs the question. If he's a mere mummer, then where might our true Arisen? Empress Nadinia's life is in your hands, Sir Arisen. Praise be, for only the Sovereign's guidance can lead us true. Long live the Sovereign of Vermont! Hmm. Oh, God. Up oh, there goes the bridge. Medusa! Oh my god. Hello, hi. Dragon's Dogma 2. What did you think? The action RPG game Dragon's Dogma was released in 2012. Now, a decade later, I'm proud to share a look at the highly anticipated sequel, Dragon's Dogma 2. Today I want to talk about two characteristics that Dragon's Dogma 2 will inherit from its predecessor. First, Dragon's Dogma 2 will be a single player game, but with pawns at your side, it will feel like co-op. Ah. Second, Gameplay will feature action role-playing mechanics set in an open-world environment. In the Dragon's Dogma series, you embark on your adventures with pawns, otherworldly beings controlled by AI. Alongside oh, AI. Arisen, you can embark AI on generated pawns that can be customized to your liking, as well as up to two additional support pawns you can borrow from other players to form a party of up to four characters. Pawns are controlled by the AI and are now capable of even more precise decisions than in the previous title, helping you in the uh. midst of battle. They can also help guide you to new locations or give you a high five following a successful battle. Nice! It really feels like playing in a party with other players. Dragon's Dogma 2 is built with the RE engine, resulting in a dense world woven with high graphical fidelity. You'll enjoy a world roughly four times the size of the original Dragon's Dogma, with more to experience than ever before. The characters and monsters that populate the world mm -hmm. are given life thanks to the power of AI, and players will feel like they've been reborn. Artificial in intelligence, fantasy. yep. You can look forward to a variety of vocations to choose from. Your vocation. Imagine if all these monsters were AI generated. Will you take on enemies with swords? Magic? It's all up to you. We'll have much more to share in the future, but for now, I want to go over a few sections from the trailer that show what we've improved for Dragon's Dogma 2. This game is designed to enable players to take on situations in their own way. In addition to AI, advanced technology like Ooh. immersive physics brings pawns, monsters, and NPCs to life. What would happen if you destroyed that bridge, or if you pulled that monster's leg? Yeah. What other exciting possibilities can you think of? 
me two There's all different possibilities. Story ...that also appear in the game's key art. Ulrika, a bow wielder with a deep connection to the Arisen. And Nadinia, a high priestess of the Bee Strain, which appear in the series for the first time. What destiny awaits? How will they affect your fate? The intricate relationships and situations you will encounter in the game are sure to keep you on your toes. During your adventure, you will come across familiar monsters from the previous game, as well Ooh. as new monsters such as Medusa. Medusa. And look forward to new player vocations and many new experiences unique to Dragon's Dogma 2. Nice. Please stay tuned for more information. Thank you so much for tuning in. Dragon's Dogma 2. Dragon's Dogma 2 will be available on PlayStation 5, Xbox Series X, Xbox Series S, and Steam. And now, a quick look at the Capcom 40th Anniversary Sale. Kicking things off, All right. we have well-known titles such as Dragon's Dogma and the Ace Attorney series. Don't miss this opportunity to pick up a few of Capcom's most influential hits at some great prices. All right. To celebrate, we're also offering a limited time bundle of some of Capcom's major titles on Steam. That cool. wraps up today's Capcom showcase. Thank you for watching. We're always mm -hmm. working on new games and updates, and we hope you're as excited as we are for Capcom's 40th anniversary. All right. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Oh yeah, this is the this is the Hey everyone, welcome. This is like the after show. Yeah, post show. All right. Um yeah, I can understand why there's so many dislikes and that's because low expectations, honestly. So yeah, so this is why you guys uh, have to like yeah, go in for low expectations. Otherwise, you're going to get disappointed. And, uh, and honestly, the new Mega Man game looks awesome, and the new Phoenix—not Phoenix, right? But the new Ace Attorney collection looks cool. Dragon's Dogma looks nice. Exo Primal looks interesting. You know what? I know everyone's saying like the showcase was bad, but honestly. I thought it was okay. Hey guys, click on this video. You'll enjoy it. I swear. 